How's it going, boys? We're working to build a community to allow for discussions or providing specifications you can relate to so you can have an educated decision on your purchases. So this is the ones that uh, were sent out for metal testing. So thank you very much to Kurt. Uh, providing something that is not something that was available to the community prior. And so this is just, you cannot, like, what he's doing for the work, uh, cannot even put a value on it because you know, all these things uh, were kind of unknowns. You get things in, you hope that the brand is reputable and they're providing you with the proper information. Uh, so what happened with these? And so out of these four knives, uh, two of them uh, came back as not reputable and not the correct information on the steel blade. Uh, so we have uh, four knives, uh, pretty uh, wide range on pricing. Uh, we have the Y Start, uh, which is the Gen O2, uh, 1599. Uh, we have a new brand, uh, this is the Yobo Tool. Uh, this one is the Aurora uh, for $69. Uh, we have the uh, Sog Vulcan for $139.95. And then that's a VG10. And then we have the Fura TC4, uh, which is $42.99. So that's the broad range of that. And two of these are fraudulent as far as the steel uh, that they actually put onto the blade. Uh, so as crazy as it is, uh, I must have bad luck with it. So I sent out the four, two of them not correct. Uh, so uh, what we're going to have for these, uh, I kind of let you guys look at these to see I guess what do you think as far as uh, the one that is going to be a legitimate and the one that's going to be uh, incorrect as far as the information goes. And then all these were also uh, tested for uh, Rockwell, so for the blade to see what the actual um, hardness was uh, for them as well. So we're going to go uh, kind of left to right uh, from here. So let's start with uh, the Y start. So the Y start, this one goes for $15.99 uh, on the blade itself. Uh, it does state uh, that it is a D2 blade. So D2. Uh, so this one is going to be one uh, that came back. Uh, this one came back at uh, 420 or 410, 420 steel uh, for that uh, Y start. Uh, so already starting out, uh, that is not appropriate. Uh, not correct for that. So in my mind, uh, that is not reputable uh, for uh, this company, uh, for Y Start. Uh, so even if they just, if they told me that it was 410, 420, that would be better. Leave that off of there and say it's whatever steel it is, and then let it let chips fall as they may. Uh, but so this one already starting off uh, is a fraudulent. As far as the information they're providing for the blade, it is not D2, it's 410, uh, 420 steel uh, for that. So next one over. Uh, so actually, we're, we're going to go also into this too. Uh, so some other uh, channels are sending out knives as well. So uh, thank you for them as well for working through the information. Uh, so the largest no, one for Love Them Knives has sent out uh, two batches. The second video just went up uh, as I'm recording this. Uh, so now he's sending out a, a huge lot of knives uh, to get tested. Uh, so well done on that uh, for Love Them Knives. Also, uh, Jack Farmboy sent out a knife as well. Uh, so thank you very much to those folks for adding to the information that's out there, uh, which we really need to keep a track of so we know what brand to go with and what to not go with. Uh, so the next one over uh, is going to be the new brand from Yobo Tool. Uh, so this one, uh, VG10, is what they're stating. Uh, for this blade uh, steel and it is VG10 uh, so good job on them uh, for uh, being a new brand and also providing information that is correct and then going back to the, I guess, the first one also for the Rockwell for this one uh, for 59.7 is uh, what this came out for for the Y start uh, second one over uh, for this one here for the Yobo tool uh, it came out to 58.8 for a Rockwell uh, for the VG10. So already down, so one and one. So one of these is incorrect. Uh, one of them is uh, not appropriate as far as what they're marking uh, for the blade. Uh, so that's where uh, we're gonna be having these two. Uh, so this is 139.95. This one is 42.99 uh, for the price point uh, on them. So for this one, yep, SOG name brand and that is correct so that is vg10 
uh, for this blade. Uh, it came in with a little bit less Rockwell uh, than the Yobo tool. Uh, so this one came in at 57.9. Uh, Yobo tool came out at 58.8 uh, for Rockwell uh, for both VG10. And then that leaves us with uh, some people's uh, bane of their existence, uh, Fuhrer gear, uh, which has kind of gone to the bottom of the list for me uh, as far as how many things they copy. And then now, not only do they copy it, uh, but they're also uh, stamping the blade uh, with something that it is not. Uh, so uh, kind of insult to injury, D2. This is not D2. Uh, so this is also 410, 420 steel uh, for this Fury gear. So great and also horrible at the same time. Uh, so it's kind of one of those things where it kind of goes around, comes around type of thing for it. Uh, but fake for why start, real for uh, the Yobo tool, real for SOG, and also fake fraudulent uh, for the Fury gear. So some of that would probably be something that you're like, yeah, well, we knew that. But yeah, maybe the $15.99, but $42.99, and they're having this be listed as D2, and it's not. Uh, when uh, companies like Firebird bring out theirs for $20, $24, $25, and that's actually D2. Um, just goes to show, uh, I guess be warned on this brand, uh, I'm probably not going to buy any other or even support any other uh, ones from Fury Gear until they get things lined out or if they ever do. Uh, but this one's uh, for the Fury Gear. Um, you're not going to probably see it on the channel. Uh, going forward. Uh, so that's something that um, kind of live and learn type of thing uh, for it, uh, but that's how it goes. Uh, for any of those things, if you have any questions, let me know. Uh, but uh, thank you to the folks that are helping out. Thank you to Kurt. Uh, Kurt could not be done without you. I know you say this while well, we're doing the work, uh, but you're providing information. Uh, so um, it's just, we couldn't have done it without you. So thank you very much. Uh, own that. Appreciate you. Uh, thank you to the community. And let me know in the comments down below as far as what you think. Uh, but fake, real, real fake. There we go. And after all that, I failed to actually show you guys the paperwork on it. So we'll go back and do that. Uh, so why start? Uh, this is the one here. Uh, so as far as it coming down, uh, so uh, 410, 420. Uh, for the Y start, uh, which is this one for the gin. Uh, then we have uh, this one, which is going to be the Yobo tool. So Yobo tool VG10. Uh, that one is going to be uh, one that's not in their system, uh, but this has already been tested against the Spider Co. Uh, from uh, Love Them Knives. Also been tested against the SOG, which also found to be legitimate uh, for that. And then we also do so do have so the SOG Vulcan. And so the same one as far as that information there. And then ending out with this one, uh, Fura, not D2. Uh, so that is also the 410, 420 uh, for this one. That actually tests out a Rockwell 59. So sorry about that. Missed out on the last part of it. Thank you again for your time.